What's up, heathens? Back again with another reaction video. <clears throat> I'm going to be checking out a recommendation from Mr. Thomas K. Um, he is wanting me to check out Rammstein's live version of Wiener Blut. Um, I've, I see the opening picture on the video, and it looks like it's going to be... He said it was dark as fuck in the comment that he left. And just from the opening picture, I... Can't imagine what I'm about to see. Um, it is a live video, so I'm, I don't think it's, it should... Lyrically, it's going to be pretty bad, I'm sure. Um, visually, if it's a live performance, then I think it'll be fine. But um, I don't know the background of the story. <clears throat> I'm reading this. I think this has the translation in the video, so I'm going to be learning everything as we go right here. But again, aside from that, I don't know the background of the story. I've only seen the opening image right here. And this one is um, one of Educated Marines videos. You, a lot of you guys have told me to check out some of their videos. So here we go, guys. We're going to check this out right now. Um, it says, in 2008, a woman named Elizabeth Fritzel told police in the town of Amstetten, Austria, that she had been held captive for 24 years by her father, um, either Joseph or Josef Fritzl. It's fucking terrible already. He looks like a sick motherfucker just in this picture. Fritzl had assaulted, sexual abused, and raped her numerous times during her imprisonment inside a concealed area in the cellar of the family home. The abuse by Elizabeth's father resulted in the birth of seven children. Three of them remained in captivity with their mother. One had died just days after birth at the hands of Joseph Fritz. I'm just going to say Joseph. I'm not really sure how to pronounce his name. Um, who disposed of his body in an incinerator. And the other three were brought up by Fritz and his wife. So she knew about it. Rosemary, who had no knowledge of her daughter's captivity, her daughter's captivity having been reported as foundlings. This doesn't make any sense. I don't know about. I don't know if I buy that. That's fucking awful. It's just fucking disgusting. It's him and his wife. That's their daughter. Bro. So they had seven children together, but she was the lucky one. This... How the fuck does this happen and you not know about it? Leise, leise, wollen wir sein, den Augenblick von 
I love Rammstein. Don't get me wrong, um, but I'm gonna. It's you know musically, it's it's gonna be a great fucking song. But I I gotta be honest and say it's gonna be hard to enjoy jamming to this, knowing what it's about. Um, <clears throat> I'm not really sure why um, and I'm not trying to like say this in, like against the band at all I'm just saying that I don't understand it I don't really understand um, why certain artists make songs about events like this I'm not saying they shouldn't. I'm not saying that they're wrong for doing it. I'm just saying I don't understand it. It's not something that I... Um, <clears throat> aside from that, he's he's doing a good job presenting a monstrous character um, with his stage presence and his voice. And, um, and in his performance, he's doing a good job of uh, portraying that. Like I said, I, I knew that I was going to love the music, um, regardless of the lyrical subject matter. These guys are incredible musicians. Um, they they always put on a phenomenal show from the live videos that I've seen. Um, but if he was trying to portray a monster with his... Um, with what he's doing in his stage presence and his voice and his vocals, he's doing a, he's doing a really good job of it. <clears throat> um, Cause he's, he's obviously taking on that character and the performance and, and, and lyrically. Um, this is a, it's a really disturbing song for me personally, just because, um, I have a, I have a seven year old daughter and, I don't like thinking about it too much, but um, just I can't imagine somebody doing that to my child, much less 
a father doing that to his own child it's just it's really it's just so fucking bizarre and just so disgusting um As an instrumental, it's bad as fuck. I'm not gonna lie. Musically, it's really fucking good. Um, while he's, <laughs> I, I love Till Lindemann. I, I love his, I love his singing. Um, but being able to read it right here, if if I didn't know what the hell he was saying, I'd be jamming out to this song. They're killing it. This is really fucking cool. <laughs> I don't want to say that I enjoyed that song. <laughs> um, musically, it was it was great. Musically, it was great. Lyrically, it was just disturbing as fuck, and it just it makes me mad that shit like that happens in the world. Um, educated Marine, the person who edited this, good job. You did a great job with it. Thank you for the um, the backstory. Um, obviously, I would have had no idea what the song. Well. A little bit, but it definitely put into, it definitely um, explained a lot more than just my assumption off of listening to it. So thank you for that. Um, Thomas, thank you and no thank you for the recommendation, dude. Um, guys, let me know what you thought about it. Um, I'm not going to lie. I love the music. Lyrically, not so much. Um that's all I really got to say about it. It was, it was a disturbing song. Um, I, I still love Rammstein. Um, I probably won't be jamming to this song much <laughs> again after this. But um, let me know what you think about it in the comments section, guys. This is my honest reaction. I'm not going to bullshit you guys. Um, I appreciate you. Let me know what you want to hear next. If it's your first time here, go back and check out my other Rammstein reactions. I promise I was nicer in those. Um, <laughs> um, thumbs up, subscribe, I'd appreciate that And check out all my other uh, reactions as well too Even if it's not Rammstein I do a lot of different genres And I have a lot of fun with this, guys um, So thank you And I'll see you on the next reaction Take care of yourselves <laughs>